everybody, I'm Molly here from Rose City RV of Michigan, and today we're at our Tawas location, and I'm going to talk to you about slide toppers. Um, one of the biggest questions we get about slide toppers is going to be, are slide toppers worth it? What do they do? So I'm going to run down that list with you. I'm going to start with the cons. There's really only one con, and it really is to a particular setting. So the biggest con with slide toppers is going to be, if you have a extra long slide, like a 20 foot long slide, and a deep slide, like a four and a half foot, 20 feet long slide, that's where slide toppers are going to give you the most trouble. And the reason for that is when you have that length of material out there, it doesn't have the tautness that you would get out of these smaller standard size slides. So when the wind blows across it, it can make a, a whipping moving sound, um, which can be annoying, um, but also more wear and tear on your slide topper. Um, and, the, and the second thing is going to be that it'll also pool water. Now, a simple fix for that is just going to be run the slide in, run the slide out. It's going to dump that water. That's fine, but it is just one thing you do have to keep an eye on. Um, the only fix that I have ever heard for this is going to be the beach ball fix. Um, and if you're not familiar with that, that's totally fine. It is an RV thing. But basically, they take a beach ball, they put it up in the middle of that slide, and what that does is provides you that pitch. So it's going to help shed that water, but also give that slide topper on that long run a taunt material so you don't have that wind whipping. Um, and that's going to be really the only con, and again, that's only going to be an issue on those really long deep slides. So most people don't have that problem. Now, if you look here, there's two different slides here, you, so you can kind of get an idea of what they look like on a narrower slide versus a longer slide. This size slide is not going to cause you as much issue as a longer one. Um, it might pool a little water, so you might have to dump that, but other than that, it's going to pretty much be able to stay taut. So, the biggest pros to slide toppers or their biggest objective with slide toppers is going to be stopping the debris from falling from trees and getting stuck on your slide top roof. So what happens when that happens is you get a bunch of needles, you get leaves, you get sticks, fall down the night while you're sleeping, you don't even know it. Um, you have no idea, you never look, you just go run the button in when it's time to go on Sunday morning. And what you don't realize is happening is all that debris is getting stuck and jammed up into your slide seals. So these little rubber seals that you see here are really just designed to keep the water out, okay? You're gonna have the same thing up there, it's gonna be a little bit thicker on the roof. But that's exactly what that is. And you can imagine you get a bunch of debris stuck in there and that's going to give you problems. Um, the biggest reasons people notice is going to be their slide is already leaking. Um, so if it's leaking inside and you can recognize that right away, that's great because you can get up there and clean it or you can have us get up there and clean it, which that's a common thing. Or unfortunately what can happen is that gets all jammed and it can leak and it can get into the wall. And by the time you're recognizing the damage, it's really too late. So that's really the unfortunate thing. So slide toppers will definitely help alleviate that problem. Um, a second big pro is going to be the UV. Most slide seals that you see are going to be black. Um, black is just the color that everybody's using right now um, and, and really always have. And the black slide seals are going to absorb that sunlight and that UV and in time that's going to break down that material a lot faster than what it would if you could keep the sun off of it. Obviously conditioning and providing maintenance to those slide seals will also definitely help make that rubber last longer. Um, but the low maintenance end is definitely going to be the slide topper stops the sun from penetrating that. So if you don't have slide toppers and you're thinking about getting them or you have questions about them, please feel free to reach out to us, Row City RV, either location. I am here all the time. I'd be happy to help you. Um, so reach out to us if you got questions. Please feel free to like and subscribe our channel if you'd like to see more content.